Yeah. KTRLTV.com slash weather. <laughs> you want more faith. Yeah. But you gotta have faith. You and I was looking faith. at at um, Mexico, although they're so far, we're kind of, you know, seeing stuff from there. You know what I'm talking the about. Smoke. The haze. Yeah. Yes. yeah. Hit it this right weekend, on the nail. yesterday was horrible. Yeah, and like, look at right now. It, it's still out there mm -hmm. <laughs> right now. Mostly cloudy conditions alongside with that. Temperatures sitting in the upper 70s and winds out of the south, southeast. That's what's going to keep that humidity at bay. Feels like already at 84, so it's going to be another warm day across the coastal bend. But we do have those rain chances in the forecast, and that starts to come into play just around that lunchtime area as we get closer throughout the rest of the day. But nonetheless, Heat is still going to be here. Going to expect those afternoon highs really to sit at about the low 90s. I think things are going to try to struggle to reach the mid 90s as these showers come into place this same time. But nonetheless, as I mentioned, still going to be a warm one here in South Texas. Temperatures start to fall to the mid 70s as we head into the overnight hours. Here's going to be that chance for rain. Once again, starting the morning off, we had a little bit of some sprinkles, isolated showers. A little bit of a break comes just before those shower starts to crank up. So it's going to be about 10 o'clock, maybe seeing some partly sunny conditions in place. But once again, haze is still going to be there. Not going to see a lot of sunshine in the mix, but the chance is still there. A little bit of a little glimpse of that as we head into the afternoon high temperature time around 3 p.m. 93 here in Corpus Christi, 96 down in Kingsville. Here's when those showers are going to start to move into the area. Once again, this is going to be very spotty. So here and there, that's when those of us will see those showers. Not all of us will see that, but the chance will Will still linger on as we head into the evening. Here's a look at 630 and then by 8. That's going to be the kind of the last push of seeing those showers by 10. I do think things will start to get back quiet and clear for us heading into Tuesday with these showers. We began also to mention that there's going to be a severe risk associated marginal to slight and even just a little bit enhanced as you head further north for our friends up in George West and Beeville. And we're really expecting light stronger winds and even hell up to one inch as these showers starts to move in. And today isn't going to be the only chance to see rain as we head later on in the week. Isolated chances are still going to be in the forecast associated with these two week fronts. Only going to be dropping temperatures about a degree or two, so not going to be much. But hey, we have to take all we can get by Wednesday and Thursday, expecting those temperatures just topping out in the low, low 90s. Feel like temperatures really reaching the triple digits 108 here in the Corpus Christi. And as things start to warm up, that's what's going to aid that chance of seeing showers get more severe. But Nonetheless, tomorrow starts to look a little bit more dry and behind that no widely scatters by Wednesday through Friday, but isolated more so for that and temperatures as you can see still sitting in the 90s. Barbie John Thomas.